Hey, hey loves, welcome back. And today I'm going to be sharing with you guys my nighttime skincare routine. I've gotten so many requests from you all to share exactly what it is that I use on my face. This video is not sponsored. It's just my own personal preferences as far as products go. And after a shower for the evening, I will use the micellar water just to remove any leftover makeup believe it or not even when you wash your face with makeup remover you'll still have a makeup residue so i always like to make sure that my eyes are completely free and clear of any makeup residue After I clean off the uh, leftover makeup, I will go in with my Tula Probiotic Skincare. I actually got this from my FabFitFun box and I love it. It is such a gentle cleaner uh, or cleanser, I should say, for my face. So I will go in and make sure that I just get anything that is leftover. I like to have a clean slate on my face for my nighttime routine. So I will go in and just make sure that I have lukewarm water. I feel like that's the key. Um, nothing too hot that's going to burn your skin or open up the pores too much but also not too cold where your pores are gonna close down so I like to go in just with some lukewarm water after I use this gentle cleanser on my face Now the next thing that I am doing is just patting my face with a clean washcloth. I feel like so many times we find ourselves uh, wiping our face and one of the things that I learned early on is just to pat dry your skin. Uh, I do the same thing also for my body when I am getting out of the shower. The first thing that I'm going to use after I have a clean face is the Shiseido Wrinkle Resist 24. This is a balancing softener that I will use um, really just around my eye area as well as my smile and my neck. So this is going to be areas that I feel that I have more wrinkles or I'm more prone to wrinkles. And this is basically going to smooth and improve the appearance of those fine lines and wrinkles that we tend to get. I think after about 34, 35, you'll start to notice a lot more wrinkles in areas that you typically did not know you had them. Now, I have been loving the Neutrogena Rapid Repair. This actually has Retinol A. It is an oil that I have just been loving for my skin. We live in an area that is a predominantly humid and even with all of the humidity, I still love this particular oil. I use it twice a day, I use it at night and um, before I actually put on makeup. And you would think that it would be very oily, but what I have been doing after I put on the oil and massage it into my face, I have been using this quartz stone roller on my face so areas that i will um, that i really just want to concentrate on i roll over my face lightly so don't put too much pressure um, the smaller end actually feels so much cooler and i will go in where i feel i have bags under my eyes as well as around my nose and just the smaller areas that i really want to get that oil penetrated into my skin Okay, so the next thing that I'm using is the Rapid Wrinkle Repair Eye Cream by Neutrogena. This has Retinol SA, so it's gonna help with those fine lines and crow's feet that we get around our eyes. I like to just get a small pea size amount on my ring finger and really just dab that into the area around my eyes. So for the last two weeks, I have been using the L'Oreal Collagen Moisture Filler and I love this. I typically will take uh, collagen in my protein shakes, a powdered form, but when I found this for my face, I decided to give it a try and I absolutely love this. It's going to restore the elastin in your face. So it's gonna basically help keep your face more taut and young and youthful looking. In addition to the collagen, I've been using the L'Oreal Wrinkle Expert and I grabbed the 45 plus. I'm only 40, 
but I feel like I really just wanted to concentrate on my wrinkles. I don't know if I'm doing my skin damage or not, but I have actually been loving this cream. It is a day and night moisturizing cream and it just goes on very smooth. I always make sure to get my neck area because as you get older, you will see that your neck area definitely changes over time. And then the last thing for my nighttime routine that I have been using is a lip treatment. So I won't always use this specific li lip treatment. Sometimes I like to go in with a sugar scrub, but I did get this one in an Ipsy bag and I have just been loving it. It's a very thick, almost Vaseline type of lip treatment, but definitely keeps my lips moisturized all night long. Okay guys, and that is it for my nighttime routine. This entire routine will take me less than 10 minutes. So I hope that you guys enjoyed. If you are not currently subscribed, make sure to hit that red subscribe button and join our little YouTube family. And as always guys, I will see you in the next one.